everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I want to show you something a bit different than Filofax. This is the last Filofax that I have I was using and um, I stopped using it since this is the last one since February. And this is because I discovered well I didn't discover it, I knew about it, but I wasn't too interested to dig into it. But I um, looked for a good system to take notes in for my university lectures and um, the system I was using was just using loose leaf paper and then filing them into a ring binder. What happened is that it wasn't working that well and it was really pissing me off. I did a lot, lot of research, um, turned to YouTube, saw what other people were using, not for um, note taking per se but you know just general journaling and stuff like that and I came across Midori now I wasn't willing to spend that much money so what I did ta-da I made one myself um, it was really cheap to make it cost me about 15 pounds just to make a large um, kaya size that's how you say it it's basically the moleskin, moleskin um, notebook size now I made my own notebooks um, these are ready to go for September. I have just a reference book where I write all my general notes and formulas that I need to refer back to in the future. And just two more. Each semester has four modules, so that's why I usually have four notebooks in here. This is a veg tan leather. It's very, very, very soft. And that's because I did treat it. It was really stiff. And I liked that at the beginning because I didn't want my notebooks to be battered in my bag. But as I was using it, I was more into softer leathers. So I treated it, rolled it, and now it's very nice and pliable as you can see. And it fits a lot of notebooks in there. And um, this is a custom size that I've made so that it's a bit longer. And that's because if I have tabs in it, it won't get, you know, destroyed in my bag. So that was how I got into Midori because of my university note taking and all that jazz. Now this is one of my many, many um, pocket size or field note size notebooks. Um, ever since this happened, I made tons more. Um, so this is one of my daily um, everyday carry right now. I change my covers very frequently every month. That's because I made so many I need to use them. Um, I could have made personal size, but I kind of liked the field note size and the fact that it's so small, I can take it anywhere I want. Um, it's a bit chunky, <laughs> um, but I, I love it. I am currently enjoying this leather. This is from Leather for Craft and this is the Veg Tan Leather. I was not keen on this leather at the beginning because this is so smooth. Um, apparently they have resin finish at the back, so the suede side does not um, rub off. But um, what I was really annoyed about was the shininess of this leather. If, if you can see, it's very shiny. So here you go. I've got tons of notebooks in here. I've got this thing that I made with the Filofax pocket size inserts. It's the card holder and a zipper, po um, and a zipper pocket. And this is the insert I made myself. Another thing about Midori is that it makes me so creative because I make my own notebooks. I don't buy moleskin. I mean, I've got a moleskin here, but I don't usually buy um, notebooks and stuff because I just make my own. Like here's an insert month on two pages um, that I've created myself on Microsoft Publisher. And I have printed it, cut it and bound it. That's my month on two pages. This insert is not very useful I just have it for the sake because I have a space here I have a week on two pages that I just just draw lines and write the dates myself so here is a typical week let me find you a typical here's a typical week it's Monday to Sunday and I've got notes here this is the place where I write my shopping list so this is um, my huge planning system this this whole half of it is my planning system here I have got um, this is quite new, I put this in a booklet recently, and this is for YouTube, um, not YouTube, sorry, blog ideas. I've got stuff that I'm writing and I, like, I enjoy writing a lot, so 
um, I thought blog would be such a good way to express some of the information I have that I want to share with other people. Here is a notebook. This is quite an important notebook. This is where I have a lot of information like passwords, um, bucket lists, groceries, uh, phone numbers. So I won't go into too much detail, but the thing I will go into detail are my book lists. Um, I've got so many things to read um, and I still haven't gone through. And this is not enough, so I have to start another book list. Every time I watch booktubers, um, it's just, there's so many good recommendations, I just need to write them somewhere. So once I catch up with my reading, I can read them. So that's that booklet. I think this is um, the second most important booklet in my planner. Here is my journal. I'm not very artistic when it comes to journals. So it's just writings. As you can see, it's just writings, events I've been through and yeah, it's just writing. And it will finish soon so I can put a new booklet in. This is the last booklet. This is where I take random notes that I come across on the internet. Anything that I find interesting or want to remember. I just write them down. So that's that's it. Um, the pen loops, I made them myself and they're very easy to make. I think I'll make a video on that because I've got several hacks to share on several types of pen loops that you can make yourself and they're so easy um, and doesn't cost you anything. Well, if you have the supplies it won't cost you anything. But this one is leather pen loop um, and I'm very happy with it because I hate having pen loops on the cover. I, I just can't, I can't do with that. Anyways, um, Another thing I wanted to quickly mention is that I have two strings in my Midori and then I piggyback them. I like them that way, that's because it's flexible. I can move them around, so when I have to write it, I can move it like this. Um, I know some people like four strings. Actually, my bigger Midori has four strings in them, um, which is fine, um, but I tend to prefer the two-string method and piggybacking them. So that's my Midori, that's all my update. I'm very sorry I haven't made so many videos, but I hopefully that will change. Um, I hope to see you very soon. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you later. Bye!